Hello everyone, welcome to Adu Minds. My name is Shalini and today in this video we will study about the optic nerve. The optic nerve is second cranial nerve of sensory nature that transmits visual information from retina to the brain. In humans, the optic nerve is derived from the optic stalk during the seventh week of embryonic development and is composed of retinal ganglion cell axons and glial cells. The optic nerve leaves the orbit via the optic canal and then runs posteromedially toward the optic chiasm where there is a partial crossing of fibers from temporal visual fields of both eyes. At the optic chiasm, fiber from the nasal half of each retina cross over to the contralateral optic tract while fibers from the temporal halves remain ipsilateral. Left optic tract contains fiber from the left temporal retina and right nasal retina. Right optic tract contain fibers from the right temporal retina and the left nasal retina. Each optic tract travels to its corresponding cerebral hemisphere to reach the lateral geniculate nucleus which is located in the thalamus. The fiber synapse here. Axons from the lateral geniculate nucleus then carry visual information via pathway known as optic radiation. This pathway itself can be divided into two which are upper optic radiation and lower optic radiation. Upper optic radiation carry fibers from the superior retinal quadrants and it's corresponding to the inferior visual field quadrants. It travels through the parietal lobe to reach the visual cortex. Lower optic radiation carries fiber from the inferior retinal quadrants corresponding to the superior visual field quadrants. It travels through the temporal lobe via a pathway known as Mayer's loop to reach the visual cortex. Once at the visual cortex, the brain processes the sensory data and responds appropriately.